How you doing? Sean O'Brien again with Two A Guys in Gear, and uh, we're going to do a video on vertical gun racks. Uh, we ran into vertical gun racks two years ago at the mm -hmm. 2015, and this year, 2016 NRA convention, and um, great bunch of guys. Yep, that's uh, the owner's Neil. Yeah, that's uh, yep. that's who we met down there, and. Uh, he has a great product, so and we'll link uh, below down to our other videos that we did with him at the show to actually highlight their products, which right. is basically a piece of aluminum uh, coated with plastic, and it holds a gun vertically. Yep. It's pretty it's, simple, right? Yeah, it's pretty <laughs> simple, and it's, it's an awesome product. It is. It is. So one thing that Sean wanted to do and that he pointed out was all the videos on YouTube show an AR-15. AR-15, yeah. Which is cool, but these racks do so much more. I don't think right. there's a gun that we found that it won't hold. So we kind of right. wanted to show you all the, the different guns that we can put on these racks. I mean, from mill syrup to shotguns to bullpups, it, um, there's not too much you can't put on here. Right. And now the one thing I know we've said it before, I'll say it again. The one thing I like about these racks is that you can actually present the guns. So right. when you're looking at them, you can actually enjoy the gun it, rather than having it tucked back in a safe or, or turned just so you're looking at the bottom of the gun or what have you. So it's just a really nice option for right. the gun. That's how I like displaying them like this. Mm -hmm. um, they make a horizontal rack, a mm -hmm. display rack. Right. Um, and we'll show that one as well. Um, but we're just going to right now show you some different rifles hung on these and, uh, and how they look. Yep. So let's start working our way through. All right. So what we're going to do is we're going to take down the, uh, the muzzle loader and we'll put up the official gun of 2A guys in gear. That's, That's the high right. point. Fits in there no problem. We're going to take down the Remington 1100 and we'll put up a lever action in a 357 Magnum. Fits like a champ. Yep. So, no wiggle room in between the two. Take this AR down and put up a uh, AK. And then the world's famous 1022. And put up the world famous yeah. M1 Grand. That's right. <laughs> So, and they all fit great on yeah. there. And I think that's the beauty of it is you take a gun down, you put another gun up, and it's going right. to fit. So. I, I like displaying the mill serps, um, especially you can squeeze them a little tighter and you can get quite a bit of them lined up right. on a wall. Yep. Um, and it looks really good. It does. So I think this is a great option for gun rooms. Uh, if you want to yeah. display something on the wall just in your living room right. or gun shop. Yeah. So it's a great option. And they cost about 20 bucks a piece. Yeah, give or take for 15 to 20, depending on which one you get. Right. Um, and of course, they have them if you buy them in bulk. Mm -hmm. They're, um, they're a lot cheaper. The price. Yeah. yeah. So like now one thing that we did have to do on some of these guns is you kind of have to tweak these a little bit. Uh, maybe something doesn't fit exactly the way you want it to, but just a little bit of hand pressure will tweak them and they seem to hold their form no problem. Right. And then you can always, uh, you know, you can bend them back if you need to. Because uh, some of the hand guards are fatter than the others. Right. So getting them, you know, sometimes you got to tweak them out a little bit to, to set it in there. But it's, it goes right back. Yeah. So. Yeah. So now what we also have, uh, we have the horizontal racks, we have the pistol racks, and the bullpup racks, right. and the extra long racks. And the extra so, long racks, they just came out with those not too long ago. Right, so we're going to reset the camera, take all this down, put those up, and show you guys the difference. Yep, be right back. All right, now we're back, and uh, we have the bullpup rack the extra long rack and this is just racks is their normal vertical rack and we're leaving this one here to, to show you in comparison it's about uh, three inches four inches taller and then we have the pistol rack yep so the uh, pistol rack is kind of nice I like to hang my pistols like this vertically right. uh, Sean kind of mixes his up a little bit and flips the rack around a little bit and secures it to the wall that way and they actually point kind of at an angle upward yeah. so I mean and, you can uh, mount them however you want. Yeah, it's personal really preference, yeah. really. So, but It can be mounted a few different ways. Yep. So now the cool thing is with the uh, these racks, and we right. had to do it on the bullpup rack, this one has the uh, the pick rail on top. So what Sean did was he just kind of muscled yeah. that over a little bit. Had to bend bit. it. Normally this one was curled up, you know, like these, but mm -hmm. I had to bend it out to so it would fit the um, the KSG. Yep. So, and uh, it fits fine. Right. So. And I really like the new longer ones, especially with you know, the longer mill syrups, yeah. the hunting rifles. Exactly. I um, mean, you think about the Swedish Mauser. I mean, that right. thing's like that tall, you right. know? So it's yeah, perfect. Those things are nice. So, but, yeah. So the, the next up, we have the uh, horizontal display rack, right. which is my favorite. So uh, hold tight. We're going to reset and, and put that one up. Yep. Yeah. 
All right, now we're back. Um, we got the horizontal display rack. Um, again, these will hold just about anything. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, I really like those too. Yeah, actually, this is my preferred rack that they have, even though they're vertical gun racks. I right. like their horizontal display rack just because, for my preference, that's the way I like seeing them on the wall. Right, to, and so. I too, all my favorites mm -hmm. I have on the horizontal right. yeah. position above the, the vertical. Yeah, and that, that works out yeah. great. So, and then once again, these are about $19, $20 each. So same price as the vertical racks. And uh, they hold just about everything. Yep. So we have our nine millimeter AR up here, but we'll show you, it'll yep. hold a few other guns too. So we'll go from the AR to the AK. No problem. Yeah, hangs right up there. Looks good. Yeah, looks great. Yep. So um, then you can take that down and throw a muzzle loader up there and it'll fit. Fits like a glove. Yep. So, and I think these are also great. You know, if you've got like hunting camp or something like that where you need a place to put your rifles overnight, you know, line a, a wall right. up in your hunting camp or your, right. your deer cabin. Or if you have them, uh, the, you know, the display rifle, display mm -hmm. only rifles. Yeah, you exactly. You want to display them and, right. not, and not, you know, make the, the, the wooden hangers and yep. all that. Um, that that's a, a better alternative. It is. I think it's a great alternative. Yep. And let's try this shotgun. All right. So yeah, so we're going from the uh, 1100, I'm sorry, from the muzzle loader to the Remington 1100. It fits right in. Yeah. So hard to beat. Yeah, I think they're I think they're great racks. Yeah. Yeah, and we just wanted to show that uh, they'll hold just about anything right. and not just ARs. Exactly. That was my big turn off to watching all the other videos. Yeah, is right. They were just showing ARs. Exactly. Um, you know, and there's so many more uses. Oh yeah, uh, yeah. And like we said earlier, there isn't a gun that we found so far that it won't hold. Right. So. But yeah, so you can check them out on uh, verticalgunracks.com. Yeah. I guess you can find us on Facebook and two A Guys and Yeah, they're they're a great bunch of guys. It's um, they're made right here in the USA, and uh, you should go check them out on their website. They're um, it's a real good product. Absolutely. And if you like us, please subscribe. Thanks. See. You.